Hello Scorpio, it is so nice to see you. Welcome to your What Will Spring Bring reading. I'm going to jump right into it. You have Temperance in Reverse, the Four of Cups, the King of Cups, and the Page of Wands. So Scorpio, in spring you may be feeling a little bit unbalanced and like you are pushing for results in something and that may be having you feel stuck. However, you are in a place of emotional maturity and ready to have a sense of adventure. That's probably why you're feeling stuck is you want this adventure. You have the eight, the nine of cups in reverse. So this eight of cups in the reverse talks about overindulgence and you also have temperance in the reverse. You may be trying to fill the void so to say scorpio with some kind of overindulgence and a lack of temperance or at least there is some kind of misbalance in your space but there is a new beginning coming that will be more stable here with this ace of pentacles you also have here expansion and growth you have this adventure and you're getting your new beginning come spring scorpio you're going to look at the way this person is just holding their wand so proudly and looking into the vast desert because there are endless possibilities and they have great posture. You can tell that they are, they're just ready for this new beginning, Scorpio. I feel like that's why you were in this stuck energy. Maybe this was an energy from before. You are feeling your emotional intelligence just be careful of overindulgence. I love the wands cards here with your page of wands and the three of wands. A, a beautiful sense of adventure for you this spring, Scorpio. You have the queen of pentacles. Practice generosity. Maybe make sure you connect with nature and connect with those around you. Oh, how beautiful. So look what I did here. I was feeling so compelled that these two cards go up that this King of Cups and Queen of Pentacles are now facing each other. And it is, if you are looking for love, this is just, I feel this is a great sign for you. If you're not, take it how it resonates, but that was beautiful. I, wow, they are facing each other. You may be meeting someone new that could be part of your new beginning. You have the Queen of Swords in reverse, don't. Like, be careful of your words, communicate, work on your communication, work on communicating well. You have the Knight of Cups, there is an emotional offer coming in. I feel a masculine energy from this read. If you are a masculine, you may be after someone you see as the Queen of Pentacles. I didn't intend for this to be a love reading. Ooh. So you guys are feeling stable and you're feeling stuck and you're ready for a new beginning and growth and expansion and you want to meet this queen of pentacles and offer this knight of cups and if you are not a masculine you could still be offering a knight of cups or you could have a knight of cups coming towards you either way again take it as it resonates there may be some kind of overburden you could be holding on to too much maybe things feel a little bit overwhelming Hmm. But there are new beginnings and choices. So you guys may be having to make a choice and that could be making you feel a little bit like burdened this spring. Hold on to your money. It does have generosity and new beginnings, but you guys need to make sure you're saving as well. And the King of Wands in reverse is a lack of power or bullying why is there bullying the queen of cups in reverse oh i feel like this is another energy your choice so ooh, spicy okay so you may have burdens and there's a choice between someone maybe in this bullying and lack of power energy who is 
not in touch with their intuition and they they may not be nurturing or as kind they could be stingy and you see here with the choices they are facing away from this energy scorpio so if you you are experiencing less than pleasant energies this spring it is something you can turn your back to we have the hanged man here with shifting perspectives and waiting maybe you guys really need to contemplate this and that's also why you have the queen of swords here in the reverse and your temperance and your eight of cups you thought you were almost there this is spicy you have the eight of pentacles in reversed that is the eight of pentacles in reverse is burnout and overworking be mindful of that i would like to get some advice for you scorpio for spring it looks like you guys have an important choice to make and it may be between love choices and i feel like you guys should follow your intuition because the way that you are facing like the energy you face I feel that's what you want and maybe this a detachment might come with burdens and that's frustrating and it can be difficult but let me get your advice advice for Scorpio for March please we have the five of pentacles the Nine of Swords and the Ace of Wands. This is a mindset of lack and anxiety, but the Ace of Wands talks about creativity and new beginnings. So I feel like you really need to let go of this self-defeating energy. Look at these cards. This March, you need to work on letting go of self-defeating energy. None of this anxiety, no poor pity me with this five of pentacles you can have new creative beginnings you can have new solid beautiful you have two aces here that's 11 and that's so many new beginnings you have the nine of pentacles that's enjoyment and fulfillment you guys this can be you celebration special events the magician in reverse you may be feeling a little bit hesitant and stuck but you have everything that you need and you need to keep that in mind let me get animal oracle for you scorpio can i please get advice for scorpio for march whoa love is all around so you may not be feeling the love right now but it is around you and you can find it we have be here now in the reversed or in the protection you have claim your independence in the protection and watch and wait with the seahorse spirit. You also have nothing is wasted and take time out. So I feel like this message is pretty clear. There is a decision you guys will be making this spring. It may be a difficult one. You can take the time out. You can watch and wait. But remember that love is all around you. Nothing is wasted. Don't get stuck in a mindset of lack and anxiety, even if it is an ending or a new beginning. It's, it's okay because nothing is wasted. You learned the lessons. I can't believe here's the moon in the reverse something is becoming clear to you claim your independence protect yourself while you claim your independence you have the three of cups there is going to be celebration i i'm excited for you i'm gonna get affirmation cards for you scorpio I feel like you may be a little bit emotionally confused. You might be facing a little bit of turmoil this spring, but it ends in celebration. It ends in the moon like clarity. Let me get for you these cards for Scorpio, please. I need cards for Scorpio, please. You've got receiving elation i am born of infinite joy you guys probably need to keep a positive mindset during this time try to embody 
the infinite joy around you and take part in it because it's everywhere. It's spring, spring, the flowers are blooming. The sky is hopefully turning blue. It's going to be beautiful and your spring should be beautiful and you can enjoy every part of it. You have creating cooperation. More gets accomplished when everyone has a role to play. And soothing and patience. There is nothing to do but wait. Maybe you guys can't take action quite yet, but if you figure out your role and you can embody this hangman energy and shift your perspective, see what the moon has been hiding. You know what I mean? Inspiring others. I help others feel empowered by acknowledging their gifts. It may help you to spend time with other people. See what's great about other people. Acknowledge other people's gifts if you see them. I'm going to get one or two more little cards for you. I think these are cute. They're a little mermaid deck. I don't remember what they're called. Sea Melodies. So this is my Sea Melodies deck. And I need... Advice for Scorpio, please, for spring. Explore. Maps show what has already been discovered. Go another way. Rescue. Help others in need or ask for assistance if you need it. Explore what is around you. Explore the springtime. Explore relationships in a healthy way and help others or ask for assistance if you need because sometimes we need help sometimes things are too hard or sometimes we see someone in need and we should be extending the hand we got generosity what good treasure what good is treasure if you keep it for yourself share your abundance share your love I think your spring will be pretty good, Scorpio. I hope you enjoyed this reading. If you do, claim it, like, comment, subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. Bye!